might be a little off here, Caspar. The interpretation is more like this. No kidding. Well, so then this part here would actually mean something like... Hey, are this and this the same? I think they connect to that one thing from before. Nice one. So now you understand that part, right? some progress today yes you've been doing quite well you used to only train your body but lately you've been spending more time on your mind you kind of got a better opinion of me now huh I mean no way did I become a genius in just five days but this still isn't bad you've been hitting the books a lot yourself lately wouldn't you rather be out on dates or something not at all. I'm working very hard for the sake of our future. Also, studying together like this is sort of fun. I get it. It's kind of like training. The more you do, the more you get out of it. But I also noticed that my training has gone better since I started this whole studying thing. Um, <clears throat> and perhaps having a partner is helping too? <laughs> Still, it makes me kind of sad. We'd probably be studying together like this a lot more if the Academy hadn't shut down. I don't know about that. I mean, if we hadn't ended up in this war... Would I have found a reason to study like this? Honestly, I kind of doubt it. Caspar, whatever's bothering you, you're not going to solve it by muttering to yourself. Yeah, you caught me. Up until Edelgard decided she was going to fight, I didn't know much of anything. Not about the evil guys who came into the Empire, and not about the problems in Fodlan. Not saying I fully understand that stuff now, either, but at least I want to try. <sighs> Seeing you now is like looking at an adorable baby brother. And I just want to pinch your cheeks and cheer you on with everything I've got. Uh, okay. I mean, sure, I'm the second son and you're older than me, but... Perfect. Then go ahead and start thinking of me as your big sister. You know what? I actually don't mind that. Well then, just keep watching me grow, big sis. <laughs> I thought you'd just laugh that off. With the passing of five sunrises and five sunsets, even a boy can burgeon into an impressive man. Ah, uh, what? Is that another part of Francis's story? Oh, that's my little secret. <laughs> Still, whatever am I to do now? Let's just continue bringing the best out of each other, for the sake of our post-war future. Our meaning... Uh, never mind, I'm with you. Let's keep giving it our all together, Dorothea.